on 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 days, Gino Palazzolo got Jasmine Pineda's mother's blessing to propose, but viewers were less than impressed with his decorum during the meeting. Gino had a lot on the line, as Jasmine made it clear that she wouldn't be with him if her mother didn't approve. Although Gino succeeded in receiving Cecilia's blessing, many 90 Day Fiancé franchise fans were critical of Gino's behavior during his first meeting with Jasmine's family. Gino and Jasmine's relationship is currently hanging by a thread, as Gino almost lost Jasmine for good after she was informed that he sent her naked photos to his ex-sugar baby. Jasmine was understandably furious with Gino over the betrayal, especially since he kept trying to convince her that he hadn't done anything wrong. However, Jasmine still took Gino back since she couldn't deny her feelings for him. Before the 90 days viewers saw Gino purchase an engagement ring for Jasmine before meeting her mother and younger sister for the first time. From the start, B90's Gino did not try to impress Jasmine's mother. While the American purchased chocolates and a card for the mom, Gino refused to break his wearing a hat at all times rule. Jasmine informed Gino that her mother was religious, so he would be expected to remove his hat during a prayer before eating. However, Gino made it clear that he wouldn't do that. He refused to take off his hat, which seemed disrespectful since he was in her mother's house and eating her food. Gino demonstrated that he was unwilling to change, even though he had no qualms about sending out Jasmine's naked photos. In addition to his faux pas with the hat, B90's Gino also fumbled several of his answers. Cecilia asked Gino why he didn't have children, and he told her that fatherhood hadn't happened for him yet although he failed to elaborate on his desire to have children with Jasmine. He also justified his age gap with Jasmine by claiming that other people have even bigger age gaps. Many viewers would have preferred to see Gino open up about his feelings for Jasmine. He also made things awkward by asking Jasmine's mother about her romantic history, a question that did not seem to be appreciated by the conservative mother. Gino ultimately did receive approval from Cecilia. He was given her blessing to pop the question to be 90s Jasmine. However, he has not made efforts to meet Jasmine's standard of living. Gino refused to purchase any new clothing and met her beloved mother in the same ratty t-shirt, sports shorts, and sandals that he has worn during his entire trip to Panama. He also chose to cut costs when purchasing a ring, which likely won't go over well with Jasmine. While Jasmine and Gino are currently together on 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 days, viewers are skeptical about the future of their relationship.